I'm Chris Spear. I'm one of the cloud solution architects here at Bytes. Customers have been traditionally adopting cloud by just moving their virtual machine estates up into cloud, which is a relatively easy, well-trodden path, but doesn't necessarily realise the full potential of cloud benefits. So it doesn't allow you to minimise cost, it doesn't allow you to take advantage of scalability or performance capabilities, it doesn't allow you to reimagine what you're delivering to your business. Customers on the cutting edge of cloud adoption tend to be building out their applications and their estate to utilise the benefits of cloud platform services to a greater extent. So uh, being able to uh, build their applications to be more flexible and scalable on demand rather than fixed size for long periods of time, as they might have done on premise. Customers can get the best out of cloud by adopting the cloud-native platform services that are available in Azure. So, for example, a subject that's dear to my heart is around data analytics. So being able to transform from a traditional on-premise data warehouse type methodology where you have you know, data being sucked in from multiple places across your organization into one big fat data warehouse, which takes many months or even years to build, architect, and uh, deliver on business requirements uh, in combination with sucking in huge amounts of data which takes a lot of processing time and effort and design time to a more dynamic cloud native solution such as utilizing uh, data lakes besides Synapse Analytics, Hadoop or HD Insight in Azure, uh, utilizing Data Factory at scale to be able to ingest data from a plethora of sources very quickly and easily without having to write much code, and also being able to uh, deliver huge scale analytics on demand without investing heavily or even at all in infrastructure. Not every customer needs to fret around just adopting cloud native services. A combination of virtual machines and cloud native services are the way to go for most customers. It's just measuring and balancing where it makes sense to adopt each. Looking to the future, Microsoft is investing more heavily in their data analytics tool sets in Azure and You'll be able to take more advantage of that as an individual customers by uh, looking at machine learning and cognitive services to complement and accelerate your data analytics behavior. So for example, bringing in behavioral analysis, looking at historical data trends in order to be able to assess what might happen next from your data sets rather than just looking at what has happened.